All right, big news coming in with regard to Arvind Kejriwal. Remember, it's a very important day with regard to the ED summons to him. Nine summons that Arvind Kejriwal has not responded to in person. Has earlier said, will come virtually, but not in person. He says that there is likely to be his arrest ahead of Lok Sabha elections. Arvind Kejriwal filing a fresh brief before the Delhi High Court. So this morning, the latest update coming in. Fresh round of Kejriwal versus ED before the Delhi High Court. Kejriwal's latest application has said, High Court should direct Enforcement Directorate to take no coercive action against Kejriwal. ED should give assurance before the court that it will take no coercive action against me if I comply with the summons. This is the fear of arrest for Arvind Kejriwal that he is repeatedly moving the High Court. Apprehending arrest in the excise policy case, Kejriwal appears to have told the Delhi High Court he is ready to appear. But there must be an assurance that they will not arrest him, that no order of coercive action will be taken against him. So today, remember, there is likely to be a fresh plea before the Delhi High Court and the hearing is also expected in this case. Our legal editor, Nalini Sharma, is joining me for the latest uh, this morning. Uh, Nalini, good morning. It's going to be very significant because Arvind Kejriwal, uh, apart from other leaders, for example, Manish Sisodia, Satendra Jain or Sanjay Singh, compared to them, Arvind Kejriwal is constantly uh, moving the court and not appearing in person for the ED. Is this a fear of arrest? And, and you know, do you think that the court can take cognizance of, the, of this, of this concern? And not and give out a statement that no arrest, no coercive action should be taken at all. Is that uh, has there been a precedent in that case, Nalini? Well, Pusha, interestingly, in this case, the enforcement directorate had first approached the court saying that Arvind Kejriwal was not complying with the summons. Yes. And ever since the ED has done that, uh, Arvind Kejriwal has been using as an excuse saying that the matter is going on before the court and that ED should not compel him to appear before them till the time the court does not give a final verdict. So now in the latest development, what has happened is that there is a fresh application that has been filed by the Delhi Chief Minister. And after the hearing that had already happened yesterday, uh, in which the summons were not stayed by the Delhi High Court, but today what Arvind Kejriwal is asking the High Court is to issue orders saying that ED should take no coercive action against him. And he goes on to say that he is ready to appear before the ED and answer their questions as long as either the court orders that no coercive action should be taken or if the ED on their own gives an assurance before the court, which is taken then on record, saying that they will not arrest him if he appears before them. So on that condition, he agreed to uh, comply with the ED summons and appear before them for questioning. And the hearing on his application is today. So it remains to be seen as to whether or not A, ED will even be willing to make give such an assurance to the Delhi High Court because on the contrary, they might say that they are in fact looking to arrest him because his custodial interrogation might be required because when he is not even complying with the summons mm -hmm. and not cooperating with the summons, okay. there is no question of him cooperating in uh, during the questioning. So it's going to be uh, an interesting hearing to watch yes. out for. The hearing is today before Justice Suresh Kumar Kheth of the Delhi High Court. Okay. It remains to be seen what happens. But for now, K. Srivan in this fresh application has moved the High Court once again. And asking the court that I will appear before the ED, but they shouldn't take a course of action. They shouldn't arrest me in this case. And remains to be seen what does the Delhi High Court say. Will Arvind K. Srivan appear before the ED or will again skip this one? We'll be tracking that big news in just the next few hours.